Hey guys, welcome back to Floyd's channel. I'm Aaron, and today we're going to be talking about um, our experience in Melville and what we um, went through and um, the people we met and just the environment, the atmosphere, um, the landscape and um, just how interesting it was just to be there for those weeks. Now, um, I don't know about him, but my experience was just incredible. Had a chance to go to a couple of restaurants and uh, nightclubs, which was interesting. I usually don't go to nightclubs, but I just had to experience um, just the culture and how it is at night. Because remember, guys, nighttime and daytime are different. So when I was there during the the daytime, it's vibey, it's cool outside. You know, you can get to eat at restaurants where they are kids. And um, during the nighttime, it's kind of interesting. Correct? Yeah. There's a different oh. atm atmosphere. But I kind of remember that I didn't introduce you. I just went to me the video. So it's kind of weird. But anyways, guys, yeah. Just, yeah, it's kind of interesting at night. Yeah, so nighttime, um, Melville actually um, come alive. But um, what I like about Melville, it's um, it seems very family oriented to me because I saw a lot of kids. Um, there was like next, there was a school next to where we were staying. Um, mm -hmm. People were walking and stuff. Um, it's a very leafy suburb Correct. in Alton Province in Johannesburg. Um, we were pretty close to everything. Um, if we get out of the Airbnb where we were staying, you go left. And there was like a whole different, um, you know, vibes. You go right, it's another vibe. If you go right, it was, there were like lots of restaurants and pubs and bars and and um, all that sort of stuff, right? Mm -hmm. And if you did go left, you'll find more um, kind of like, uh, what do you call those kind of businesses? Like industrial businesses, right? Mm -hmm. On that side. Remember that, right? Yeah. Yes. So, um yeah, so where where we stayed um was really really cool. Um, the owner of the Airbnb lived right next to us, actually in the same property, same lot, but just you know, they're like space away from us. Um, uh, they had a dog. Um, name was what's the dog name? Barbara. 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 Yeah. That dog and is just hell. The dog Sent never from likes him. <laughs> Sent from him. Oh. The moment I walked in. Yeah. The moment I walked in, guys, it was just barking at me, wanting to take me out. I just, Barbara was just, but I like Barbara, but Barbara is just too aggressive. I think she wanted like some treats or something. Yeah, and... Barbara just wanted us to pet him down and just. It's a she or but, he? But it's a she. A she. Mm. She was just terrible. Mm. I think she needs more love. <laughs> Anyways, so um, so we did went to a few clubs in Melville, um, since Melville um has been known for a little party city at nighttime. There were lots of lots of young younger folks like him, um, because there are like a couple of colleges in that area, so um. During the evening, they all come out, especially on the weekends. Because we've been there on a Thursday night, it was popping. Friday night, more popping. Saturday, Saturday popping. was. Yeah, it was Sunday, off the chain popping. on Saturdays. Well, never been there on a Sunday. Sunday. Yeah. But those days that we mentioned, Thursday, Friday, Saturdays. I just, I'm just assuming that Sunday nothing happened. Probably, because Monday is people. Okay, are we touring? Um, we doing kind of like what now? <laughs> Perfect. So like just <laughs> Friday. We the Friday first time shots I went now. To okay. <laughs> so <laughs> so um yeah so we visited a few clubs you and take that out. Firing shots, Edu. Okay. Correct. Yes. So club scene was just perfect, amazing. Like yeah. I like, I really enjoyed it because it's just the energy. Like, I, I don't drink. And when I walked into a club, it was just the atmosphere is amazing. Amazing. <sighs> 
So, so if you're watching this, <laughs> just know that um, I'll go. Even if you don't go to clubs, a nightlife, try it out once. Okay. If it, it's not my thing, but I enjoy the energy. The moment you walk in through those doors, it feels like everybody's happy and they are happy because remember everyone goes out to be happy, to relieve stress, to meet new people. Okay. So there's no tension like being in an office, for instance, you know, it's just at an office at a nine to five, you'd go there and there's tension because it's just, you have to meet the deadlines, you have to, you know, get work done. But at clubs where people are just happy and they just wanna let go of stress and meet new people, that's where th the energy is okay right and we have also been to uh, parks and we've also been to restaurants so i have experienced everything and i'm telling you right now if you're watching this go ahead experience those things go ahead experience clubs nightlife go ahead, even if it's not for you try experience night nightlife clubs go ahead experience go to restaurants go ahead go to clubs go to nature reserves you know, go go on a hike, go on a mountain. It's just beautiful. Experience everything while okay. you can. Because Marvel is beautiful. The hell? <laughs> okay, guys. So yeah, um about uh, we could talk a little bit about cost of living um in Marvel since we spent a week there and I remember we spent under five hundred dollars, which I a day. did half and he did half. A day. We like and we could spend like Oh, 500 to like 700 rents rents a day a day but we didn't spend that much because the end of the day we the total value in us we spent was like about 450 us dollars but how much is that in rents well i'm not too sure but that's what we spend in us and that was a week yeah i know i spent like 200 maybe 20 30 us for the week he paid around the same that? and how much is that I don't know. I know it's 16 or 17 to 1. Mm -hmm, you correct. paid half. I yes. paid half for everything. Yes. yes. So it's like, yeah. So when I check, I spent about 225, 230. You spent around mm. close to the same or under. Mm. And um, that was included. Mm. But we paid for our Airbnb as well for the week. Food, drinks. And so it's very, um, It's I think it's safe to say that it's, Reasonable to live in Malva, mm. right? Mm. Um, I think it's reasonable to live anywhere in the world. I just think that people are just not true. It just depends on what you eat, and it just depends on what you buy. Well, I mean, my travel buddy doesn't eat a lot. I eat a lot, and I like eating more healthier food. So that's a little bit overpriced. That's why I'm saying it depends on what you eat. I would eat a lot of greens. I would eat a lot of fruits. And I will take in a lot of um, fluids. Right? And I would also have junk. And that's why I'm saying it depends on what you eat on a daily. Well, but I would say as well, sorry, excuse me, that... Um, your budget really depends on on what you eat. Yeah, so if you, you know, you purchase your grocery and stuff from, you know, the spa or the oh, supermarket, really? you guys call it spa, we, right? Yeah, oh, you guys uh, call travel it spa. buddy, look, in <laughs> spa, there's checkers, there's pick and pay, there's shop, right? There's hoolies. Yeah. We would buy food at hoolies and we'd buy food at checkers. Right, and we did pick and pay once, and the food was terrible. In what sense? So you're saying the food at um, Checkers was no good. I'm not saying it was no good. I'm just saying some items are good, but oh, the okay, chicken okay, okay. is terrible. So comparing, Guys, I would never, I would never, I'd rather buy chicken from pick and pay and cook it at home. I'd never buy uh, already cooked 
chicken at pick and pay or checkers. I'd not do that to myself, but I would buy chicken from Hoolies because I know they're not the same. They're just not the same. Or I would rather kill my own chicken and eat it. <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay. I'd rather grow my own chicken. Raise your own it, chicken. Raise my own chicken. Slaughter the chicken. Not myself or myself. Don't give a damn. <laughs> and cook it and eat it. Okay. So you're trying, to save, than, you're trying to save every dye. Yes. Rather than buy a pre-cooked chicken at uh, Pig and Pay or Checkers. Not my thing. Mm-hmm. So, um, what are just um, being honest? So, what are some of the places we visit in Melville that you remember? Uh, uh, we think uh, in the vicinity of Melville, because we went out there of were a lot. I just need to just go, just go on my list and just um, look around. But there was just, I, I think we visited. Um, um, what was this thing? Uh, I could tell I you. Not. While you stay, ahead? while staying yes. in Melville, uh-huh. we visit the zoo. The zoo, yes. We visit um, mm-hmm. uh, Joe Bark Market. That was yes. it. Uh, no, the zoo is the zoo in in Melville. No. Johannesburg Zoo. I don't no, know. we we were in Melville, but, but we, we went, went out went of to, yeah, but not in Melville. No, no, we went out of Melville to yes. the zoo, right? To, yeah, but it's then, not in Melville. But no, it's not we, in Melville. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah then yeah. we visited um. Okay, so we visited a lot of places out of Melville, but we stayed in Melville. Correct. Right? Yeah. So we visited um, neighbor Good Market. Um, yeah, but jo- out of Melville. Just say in Johannesburg. If you okay. say in Johannesburg, then yeah. In Johannesburg, we visited yeah. those places. Mm-hmm. We visited um, the list. We have the list. We have a list. We, we went to a um, lot of places. Yeah. Like if you have Only pictures, place. just post them here. Yeah, I'm going to post them. Because my travel buddy, right, here, is just... He does not like travel. He's just not like experiencing like a lot of new things. I, but 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 I like adventure. No, no, no. I love I love it. You like the mountain life. Yeah, I love nature, guys. Nature. I love nature. I, nature I would do anything for nature. I love the outdoors. But like nature outdoors, like I, I don't like being out all the time. But if I were to go out, I'll take a walk or just go to those. When, when where a lot of people don't usually go so like nature 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 all the time nature is my thing i would i would do like just just i love nature and just natural things that yeah. earth has to has to give to me yeah but we visited um and everybody else out there yeah we visited a lot of places outside of melville while we we were staying in melville um We've been to uh, Sandton City. Mm-hmm. Um, I mean, we've stayed in Sandton City before. We stayed, yeah, we did stay there before. Just, yeah. It's just we have been there, but we've been to, stayed um, there before. Sa- Tasha's restaurant. Tasha. We've been to a Tang. We've Tang, been to um, Tagger's Eye, I think. We've been to mm-hmm. Paul. We've been to just Ocean Basket. We've just yeah, been that seafood place. Yeah, that seafood place was good. We've the fish was good. We've been to a lot of restaurants and just others I can't remember now. We visit that a particular restaurant in Melville. Um, yeah. I, I think we get less for our money in that one. That very first restaurant. The very first restaurant. Right off Seventh Street. Right off. You remember that? Yeah, I remember. Yeah, it those is, guys when the they family, take us to the, the back family. family yeah. yeah, I think it was overpriced. Overpriced. I think yeah. a lot of restaurants is just over. That's how restaurants work. Yeah. But we've been to a lot, guys, both in Johannesburg and Cape Town. I've been to yeah. a lot of interesting restaurants and we've enjoyed the, uh, different food items. Oh, it's just amazing, guys. I just... I yeah, we kind of off topic f- <laughs> from Melville to Cape yeah. Town to... Uh, you know, I'm just saying we experienced quite a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah we did. Yeah, and we're still going to experience quite a lot. Yeah, we did. Mm-hmm. So, um, what else do you want to add to this? Or should we end it? I if they if guy if you guys want to have any questions, I mean we we, we I'm not, we're not able to say everything on this video, but if you have any questions, just uh, comment down below so we can get to answer them directly. Because there's a lot of things that we're not saying in this video, <laughs> and there's a lot of places that we have visited that we are not um, that we're not that are not in this video. Yeah. 
because it's not in our head right now. So, you know, um, it's just no, this no is, human. We, there's a lot of things we're missing. We didn't write his script. This is just a this, video. It's just it's gonna come to our mind mm. and talk about it. So yeah, and um, now I'll take this opportunity to ask you guys to please like, comment, subscribe, and share this video with at least one friend. And um, like I said in previous videos, we still have lots of videos coming because we did a lot of activities here in uh, Johannesburg, South Africa. And until next time, guys, peace. A peace.